Hey y'all, so I have, um, my new obsession is these quirky holidays um, that go on throughout the year and somehow I'm 30 years old and I have never known that every day of the year there's something to celebrate. So because I never knew, I figured you guys maybe don't know either. So I'm here to enlighten everybody that there is something to celebrate every day. So today is, what is the day today? The 20th is Thursday. Um, June 20th so today is recess at work day and I figured what better day to start out this celebration than recess at work like I love that so I figured today I'm going to run by Dunkin Donuts and get some donuts and maybe some coffee and take it to work and we are going to sit back put our feet on our desk and take a recess and I am so excited I cannot even see straight. So I wanted to invite all of you guys at work, whether you're a stay-at-home mom or a firefighter or a nurse, put your feet up, relax. Whatever you're doing can wait 10 minutes. Well, if you're a nurse, be ready to go because something major could happen. But for the rest of us, 10 minutes will not make a difference. So put your feet up, relax, Take a picture and share it on my page. I would love to see what recess at work looks like for you. But I also wanted to give you a heads up because through the weekend there are a lot of fun things that we can celebrate and I, I know some of them may take a little bit of planning. So Friday the 21st is two things. One, take your dog to work day. So I highly recommend us get on that. I don't have a dog, but I am going to borrow someone's dog because I know Jim is going to love this holiday. So take your dog to work on Friday, and it's also ugliest dog day, and we all know there's no ugly dogs, but there are some that maybe have a snaggle tooth or have one eye that's popped out. Take a picture of your dog, and we want to see who has the ugliest dog. And then Saturday is, get ready, Great American Backyard Campout. So, Get your tents out, take your couch in the backyard, whatever you have to do, get in that backyard and celebrate the Great American Camp Out with your kids or yourself on Saturday. And then Sunday is Pink Flamingo Day. So I know some of this is gonna take a little bit of planning because you gotta go find your tent and your pink flamingo, but get those flamingos out in the yard. And I plan on getting a few myself and decorating some people's yards. So if you end up with a flamingo in front of your house, it's me, but we're just celebrating, so don't get all worked up, okay? So today, recess at work, send me some pictures, post, tell me what you're doing. I just want to know what that looks like for you guys. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.